In a remarkable display of cultural exchange and community engagement, by the grace of Allah, a series of four book fairs were successfully organised during the month of September in Uruguay. The organisers, by the grace of Allah, embarked on this enlightening journey across the San Jose Department, which comprises 19 departments similar to provinces. The book fairs, which took place in the cities of Rodriguez, Ciudad del Plata, Libertad and Asilda Polia, not only provided an opportunity to sell books to an eager public, but also served as a platform to introduce the Holy Quran and the beauty of the Arabic language to the local communities. One of the standout features at these fairs was the offer of having people's names written in Arabic, a charming gesture that helped break the ice and spark conversations with many attendees. Additionally, visitors were treated to complimentary servings of Moroccan tea, a delightful blend of black and mint tea infused with sugar and cardamom, fostering new friendships. In total, 33 books were sold during these events, with Jesus in India emerging as the most popular choice among attendees, closely followed by selected verses of the Holy Quran, Notably, two complete copies of the Holy Quran in the Spanish language were sold, with only one remaining in Uruguay. The impact of these book fairs extended beyond book sales. Several books were generously donated to local libraries, enriching the literary offerings available in these towns. In a highlight of the series, the organisers were granted the opportunity to make a presentation on the Holy Quran and the Arabic language in a Silda polier, accompanied by a radio interview. Furthermore, they had the privilege of meeting with the intendant of the San Jose department, further strengthening the bonds between the organisers and the local community. These book fairs not only promoted literature, but also served as a bridge for cultural exchange and understanding. The organisers' dedication to spreading knowledge and fostering connections was truly commendable and their efforts are sure to leave a lasting impact on the communities they touched. Samira Mirza, MTA News.